What's going on, y'all? Micah here, and I'm back with another boxing breakdown. Man, I had to go back to Street Beast, man, because uh, the struggle, man, it just, God, man, it was all over the place, man. None of the guys could fight. At least this one, I know one of the names, so I know it's going to at least be an entertaining fight, even if they aren't the most polished guys. So this one right here, man, is Fair Play versus Warzone. Man, if you don't know who Fair Play is, he's basically the guy who dresses up like a butler all the time. And he, uh, you know, he, he knocks people out. But I don't know if his, uh, his skills are, are exactly there. I mean, I guess they're coming along as time goes. But, hey. And uh, Warzone, I don't know who Warzone is. But with a name like Warzone, he better be putting up some big numbers. Let's see what we can learn from this fight. And let's see what uh, we should never do in this fight. Like, comment, subscribe. Let's get to it. 6'2", 200 pounds, fair play by Shout out Animals of War. We're here for a third one. That boy went to Party City. Ricardo, unknown right here. Let's see what we can get. Let's go. Work on 6'5", straight out of South Florida. 6'5". All right, guys. You already know what I said earlier. Come in, touch gloves. Go and touch gloves. Who is this bump? We got the time ready? All right, fighter ready? Fighter ready? Let's fight! Establish our jab, man. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Warzone ain't looking like it. Uh oh. Slide up, slide up. Slide up, slide up. Regroup. Regroup. No pushing, no pushing. Let me go. You can pick a man. You can pick a man. There you go. Yeah, hand movement. Say hand movement. We got no jab right there. Oh, ooh, oh, ooh, ooh. I mean, that was that was some sloppy but good head movement by Fair Play, man. You never want to just put your head down if you're fighting somebody who's actually decent. But Warzone obviously is not decent, as we can see from the combinations and the way he's throwing his punches. So uh, make sure that when you are boxing and you are hitting somebody or you moving out the way of their punches, don't be just like this. <laughs> Oh, make sure you know you're kind of looking around, seeing what's going on, man. Having your hands up, unless I guess it's just super sorry in there, self check like this guy. But let's keep going. Ooh, ooh, oh, ooh, one, two. Uh. Trash. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh! That boy's slick as fish grease. One minute, fighter! Oh, Alright man, so we clearly know who won that round, man. Fair play, man. I'll, I'll really, if, he, if he didn't throw no punches, he could have won that round off ring generalship alone, man. But them body shots at the end, man, they were stinging, man. And that's what happens when you have your elbows up too high and you're trying to have a, a high guard. I guess that's what he was trying to do, but it didn't look like much of a guard. It was a trash guard if you really want to be 100 about it. But uh, yeah, man, you had your high guard, man. You got to... You gotta have a happy medium, man. You can't have your elbows all the way up here and be up close on somebody. You gotta have them right in the middle. And if somebody hits you to the body, you lean, block it with your elbow. They hit you to the other side, lean, block it with your elbow. They cut. They decide they wanna hit a, a body and then head hook, you lean, and then you back up already. So you ain't even gotta do no <laughs> with your hands and everything like that, man. So make sure that you stay home with your defense. Don't be a sorry sucker like Warzone. All right, let's keep going. Fighter, you ready? Fighter, you ready? Alright, let's fight! Alright. Who do you see? Who do you see? There you go. Ooh, ooh. Let him swing. Get up, buddy! Get up, buddy! There you go. 
Man, you messed up his outfit, bro. Oh, who the body shot though? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Little shoe shine. And he straightened up his outfit. <laughs> that boy tired as hell. Ooh. Ah. Oh. <laughs> what? him up like he's a seasoned boxer of 10 years plus and Warzone is just just getting into the gym man let's keep going oh he took the shirt off uh oh Knocked out, bro. Walk for it, though. I know there's only body shots, but I ain't got any shots. You can't throw pressures if you're leaning on you. You gotta get him off you. Alright, come on, guard yourself a little better, bro. Guard yourself a little better, bro. Are you ready? Shoot that as I'll do. This is the last round. Give it now. This is the last round. Deliver shot. Deliver shot. There you go. Deliver shot. Okay. He can't do it. That's it, guys. That's it. That's it. Oh, man. Hey, man. Good fight. You brought me a couple good times, man. No, he did not, bro. All right, man. So that's the end of the fight, man. Y'all saw what happened, man. Fair play was just being nice at the end. Talking about, yeah, dude, he rocked me a couple. No, he did not rock you, bro. He hit you like one time. You didn't even flinch, bro. But anyway, man, uh, Warzone's big trash. Uh, that was still entertaining, even though uh, neither guy was really putting up no extreme technical technical numbers or anything like that man um fair play was landing those body shots like crazy man he even hit him with a little shoe shine body shot and then a, a overhand right man but uh it wasn't clean one thing i will say about his body shots and uh anybody that throws body shots you cannot throw them like fair play fair play was able to get away with that because one warzone was garbage and two warzone was garbage and then maybe three because he had some kind of long arms man but uh you need to lean. You always have to have to squat down a little bit when you hit your body shots and get your head off the center line. Fair zone, fair play did not get his head, his head off the center line, and he did not squat whatsoever, man. If it was a real guy or a decent guy in there, 
that was fighting on man, it would have been curtains for him, man. He would have he would have capitalized off that man. Cause think about it, every time you you hit to the body, you're open like that. And that's another thing that I always talk about in my videos. When you hit to the body, you gotta come right back to the head, man. Cause otherwise you are open, man. If I just hit to the body and I'm standing up like this, overhand right, if I hit to the body, I'm standing up like this, hook. Come on, man, you gotta do a little bit better. If I hit to the body and I'm right here, like this, I'm doing, am I doing a, a dance move or am I boxing? Jab, jab, one, two, knock out, man. So think about all that when you're in there, man. Uh, clearly neither guy ran, man. Fair play was just able to get away with it because Warzone was big trash. He didn't have no type of cardio. He didn't. He obviously don't work out or run. He just was like, man, I'm hood, man. You know how hood guys think they can beat up anybody, man. It don't matter. You can be like, man, you uh, you think you could beat up uh, uh Francis Ngannou? He'll be like, yeah, he'll be, he, he been up them five, seven, uh, 140 talking about some. Yeah, I could beat up Francis and Ghana. No, you cannot, bro. Like, but but you know how these guys have this delusional confidence, man. He thought he could get in there, man. Fair play is not that good, but at the same time, this guy has not been working out or doing anything, and no boxing, obviously, be, and still thinks he can get in there. I guess he won a couple street fights against the local J at the gas station and thought he could win. But yeah. That's it for the fight, man. What did y'all take from it, man? I didn't really take nothing from it, but I, you know, I told y'all what I, what I, what mistakes they made, and uh, hopefully you'll take that into your next outing in the ring. But uh, yeah, if you watched up to this point, man, thank you. Have a great day, and I'll see you next time.